For the plate loaded leg press, you want to make sure you have in good position. You can start either with a once or close depending on uh, which part of the quad you're trying to target. Uh, here I'm using a little bit of a wider stance. I'm doing a drop sit here, so the point of that is uh, just continuous time and retention of the quad. So uh, a few tips on the leg press. Never hyperextend the knee. Uh, this is really important just for safety in general. So you want to flex the quad without fully locking out the knee. Uh, that's going to be really, really important. Uh, consistent movement. Try not to pause at the top or the bottom. Keep constant tension on the muscle throughout the movement. Uh, your breathing is going to be important as well. Exhaling on the way up, just like a squat. And then spinal position, obviously, you want to keep your back against the pad. As you're coming down, your butt should never lift off the pad just to keep your back in good position. So you want to come down as low as you can, bring your knees as close to your chest as possible. But if you don't have adequate hip mobility, if your hips uh, are lacking in flexibility, basically, uh, your butt may try to come off of the pad which is not gonna be good for the spine, uh, especially if you have a good amount of weight on the leg press. So always make sure you're able to maintain good posture uh, throughout the movement as well. Uh, give this uh, drop set a try. Uh, it's not really for beginners, but uh, build up to it. Uh, once you're able to go fairly heavy, uh, then you, you'll probably be ready. So after you set a couple of uh, PRs, then, uh, and I don't like to go super low reps on leg press either. When I say PRs, there's no really reason to do a one rep max on a leg press. You're not really achieving anything. So I like to just see how heavy I can complete. A set of eight would be the lowest repetition range that I would go for leg press. And uh, from there, uh, once you're able to go fairly heavy for a good set of eight, uh, then you can try something like a drop set like this. Anyway, don't forget to subscribe uh, for more exercise tutorials and uh, hit me in the comments with any uh, questions or suggestions for future videos.